you like it? I know, it's amazing. Did you expect it like that? No, I mean, there's probably about twice as many as there was in London, but it's mad. His first premiere. Is this your first premiere here in New York City? Or were you at the New York, yeah, yeah. Listen, we know your your character evolves in the books, especially by book five. But has Alfonso started to show some of that in the movie already? Um, well, there wasn't really much to see in the the third one, but I'm sure they'll be in the fourth and then carry on with the fifth. I don't know if they're doing the fifth yet, but yeah. Uh, shorter, which is a, a blessing to a lot of parents. Uh, significantly shorter, about a half hour shorter. Um, and it's darker. Its palette is darker. I always want to I, I want to be cautious in saying that it's not really scarier. It's not scarier than Chamber of Secrets. It's just a little darker. And it's, I guess, in the thematic elements. So. We've been talking to the cast about how many screaming fans there are here, and they're saying it's twice as many as the last time. Are you amazed at how many have come out today? I'm absolutely amazed, which is great. It's, it bodes well for the opening of the film. <laughs> I hope these people show up at the theaters. I'm sure they will. Oh, another Harry Potter film. Yeah, I, I think so. I think I'd love to, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Well, well, it's very, very. Uh, to me, it's it's he's working in the spirit of the movies, which is important. So um, it's basically visually, uh, he was able to get the kids win, which is wonderful. It's one of the things I love about the film. They can actually do an entire scene now without stopping. On the first film, it was it was just it was torture to just get one line without them looking to the camera. Second film, maybe two or three. And when you see this film, you realize they can do an entire sequence in one shot. Yeah. I guess so. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. This film is amazing. So tell me about your character. You're all growing up, but the boys and you as well. How was it doing it this time around, this movie? Uh, it was, I had such a great time. It's my favorite script, my favorite book. It's a great part of Hermione. I enjoyed it so much. And you're building a new one at the moment, is that Yep, right? two, started two weeks ago, um, and it's going really well. New director, English, great. Have okay. you had a boyfriend in real life? No. <laughs> okay. Hey, how you doing? Amazing. It's so great because it's, it's really gratifying to come out here and everyone's saying, and everyone's like, um, you yeah, know, it's just really great to, to have this kind of appreciation. It's fantastic. And everyone says the cast have really grown, not obviously in size as well, but their performances as well. This is the best performance they say so far of the three. Do you agree? I, I, I hope so. I think it's good if we just keep developing. I, I hope it is. I can't really judge. I'm, way just, I'm kind of quite self critical, but it's good because if I wasn't self critical, I'd be arrogant. So, yeah. <laughs> Do you have a favourite film? Is this your favourite so far? Uh, th like they keep when the second film came out, it was my favourite. When the third film came out, it's my fa it's my favourite. I mean, they keep getting better and better in my opinion. And what do you still like? What do you enjoy about playing Harry? Well, you're playing just an amazing, uh, really challenging, different character. I mean, it's great. It's great doing the work. Um, like? Not at the moment, no. Yeah. So. Well, I hope you might play all seven movies. Play the role. Pardon? chance that you will play in all seven movies? I've got no idea. I'm definitely doing the fourth and then after that, who knows? Okay, thank you. Well, we hope you do. Thank you, thank you so much.
Catherine Collins reporting for the Dark Lord Net and the Harry Potter Fan Zone. That was our exclusive coverage of the world premiere of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Hope you enjoyed today. I certainly did. Look for me next when I'll be reporting from the Harry Potter fan trip in York and London, June 1st to June 6th. And also look at both sides throughout the week as we bring you updates from today's events and also from the May 30th London premiere of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. See you soon. Thank you.